The fourth suspect, unnamed for more than two years, has a criminal history for trouble on the road. Sandra Chapman joins us with more on that. Sandra. Gary Thompson's arrest history stems from repeated driving violations. Arrest records show Thompson had a habit of getting behind the wheel unlawfully. In December 2008, he was taken into custody as a habitual traffic offender. He had been caught driving while suspended. It was his second driving arrest in less than two, a two-week period. In late November of that year, police caught him speeding and discovered Thompson had been ordered off the road for 10 years until 2018. The suspension was the result of a 2007 conviction for operating while intoxicated. Now, based on police reports, portable breath test in that 2007 case registered 0.21, nearly three times the legal limit for driving drunk. Well, like his co-defendants, Mark and Bob Leonard, there was nothing in Thompson's criminal history suggesting involvement with explosives. Until now, only low-level crimes that kept him in and out of jail. Now, prosecutors have not said if they will seek murder without parole for Thompson. We'll learn that as more information comes forward.